What's up, what's up, what's up, honey? It is your girl, Miss J, honey. Oh my God, it is wine down Friday. Wine down Friday, honey. <sighs> what a wonderful week. Thank God for Fridays. Fridays are, I guess, one of my favorite days now because I get to do a wind down Friday with you guys, which I love. I love the chit chatting, the spending the time together. Mm, it's just like a little taste of heaven, honey. Well, as y'all can see, I have these flowers that's taking up a lot of my space. Thank God for Jesus, honey. Somebody love Miss G. Well, you know who it is. It's my boo, Stan. <laughs> Well, everybody know he's away. And so he sent them to me. I thank God for Jesus for you, Stan. Thank you, honey, for thinking about me while you're on vacation. Mm. Ladies, what y'all think that might mean? He can't concentrate without his chick. Mm -hmm. Somebody missing me, missing me. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Of course, I'm missing him, too. You know, for all the right reasons and some of the wrong ones, too. You know, like taking out the trash. Going to the store for me. <laughs> Going to get us some fried chicken. <laughs> Popeyes. Uh, sandwiches. You know, all that stuff. <sighs> I think when you come used to something, and when they go away for a minute, you be like, what the world? I gotta go out the house. I'm not used to going out the house. <laughs> I don't went to the grocery store that much. <sighs> now, if you're new to this channel, girl, or oh, guys, Make sure you subscribe to this channel, honey. Show me some love. And if you already have subscribed to my channel, oh, thank you for coming. Thank you for stopping by and showing your girl some love. Thank you for your visit. I thank you for your time, too. Even if you're a new subscriber, I thank you for your time. Because we all know time is valuable. And we all busy. We all got stuff to do, honey. But to give me a little bit of your time and share with me, Mmm, I highly appreciate it, honey. Now, also, don't forget to give me some thumbs up. And leave me a comment. I do respond. All you gotta do is ask all the people that leave me one. I do read them and I do thank you. It means a lot. All right, so today is a day that the Lord has made and I will rejoice in it with my beautiful flowers. I'm not gonna tell a lie. Stan knows I love flowers. And a just because flower, mm, that is right up my alley. Just because. That's what I'm talking about. Not waiting for a special occasion because every day is a special occasion. Every single day is a special occasion. Mm. This is a cab. This is a good cab. Now I'm going to apologize too because my flowers, trying to get them in my little shot, takes up a lot of the space okay that's a little better but I wanted to make sure you could see them I wanted to share <laughs> they can be for all of us I mean mainly for me though because Stan sent them to me you know how that is it is raining here today and I have my back door open so you probably can hear that dog barking or you'll hear some birds but that nice cool air hitting on me mm, feels some kind of good I'm not gonna tell the story Mm. That cab is good, honey. It's gonna pour me a little water. <gasps> Nothing like a little aqua. Mm. God, that sounds smell good out there. I mean, it sounds good out there. It's like uh, the wind is blowing and the rain is hitting down. Ooh, nice and soothing, honey. Mm. That is good. So, the kids was good this week, and I did walk, even though I had to walk by myself a lot, but I did walk this week here, trying, I'm trying my best, y'all, and thank God for all the people that's praying for me so I can do good, honey, in this journey of trying to eat healthy and shed a couple of pounds. Now, we all know men and women, mm, seem like it's easy to get on. I mean, we work at getting it on too, don't get me wrong. But it's a lot more work it seemed like to get it off. But it's gonna come off. <laughs> mm -mm -mm. 
that is some kind of good 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 that is scrumptious i don't know if y'all like cabs um i'm not uh, big on sweet but i think i'm gonna try and um try some white wines because i do like certain white wines um so hopefully for the next couple of fridays i'll try some white wine <laughs> so everybody can be happy miss g why are you always drinking a red dry i like it but like i said there's some white ones i like so i will try those too but i hope all y'all gonna have a glass of wine this weekend and if not wine you know a shot if that's what you like or a beer if that's what you drink you know just you know exhale oh yes 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 honey that's what we all have to do we have to take a little me time just a little because especially when you have kids or a husband or a significant other you know even a boyfriend girlfriends too child all oh, that's work <laughs> It takes a little bit of time away from yourself. But sometimes it's good work. Because I believe a relationship is what you make it. If you work at that relationship, guess what? You're going to have a good relationship. But if you don't work at that relationship, you might just have a relationship. Mm. That's good. Mm. Mm -mm. It even smells good too. Mm, 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 mm. Oh my God, that's so good. Mm. Relationships really are very, very good to be in. A healthy relationship. I mean, I'm no expert. But healthy for me is when you can get along. You can say really what's on your mind. You can have great conversations. You can squash an issue before it just manifests into something it doesn't have to be. It was one thing Stan had told me and I think that is true. He can be good <laughs> inside my head. <laughs> I'm driving myself crazy. My mind is making me think something is bigger than what it should be. And it probably was just something simple. But something inside here started making you think outside the box when you probably shouldn't think outside the box. So if you talk about it, then it doesn't blow up into something enormously because you discussed it. What bother you about it? See now, little things, they might irk my nerve. Like, if I'm being honest, don't touch me either. I like when you walk into a bathroom, if the seat is all the way down, it makes, to me, your bathroom look nice and clean. I don't like when the lid is up. Not the seat part. I don't even like if the lid is up. I like the seat down and the lid down. So when you walk in, it just looks nice and clean. Pet pee. And he works at it because he knows that's what I like. <laughs> Compromise. For instance, hmm, he probably don't like my sassy mouth, but I got it. I can't get rid of that. <laughs> he don't say nothing though. <laughs> Thank you for loving me, Stan. <laughs> that part I can't change. But he doesn't really have a pet pee, I must say. And if he do, he's been keeping it to himself. He probably can hold on to a secret really good because it's been seven years. And he has not said he had a pet pee. But me? <laughs> I promise you. <laughs> he'll go in and every now and then he'll leave the seat up. I don't say nothing like, oh, why you left that seat up? I don't do that. <laughs> I go and I say, oh, Lord, Stan going to get it one day where he'll leave that seat down. <laughs> I do say it loud enough so you can hear it, but that's not complaining. That's just saying my thought out loud. It's a difference. 
<laughs> Give me some credit, y'all. <laughs> but I do got to say I miss Stan a lot. Um, it's not the first time that he went someplace without me. I'm going to be honest. But it is really the first time he went someplace without me for this long period of time. <laughs> he'll go to New Jersey because his grandkids live there and his son and his daughter and so he'll go up there for two or three days and his sisters he has sisters that live up there and he has a brother that live in, in uh, Pennsylvania and he tries his best to get up there when they're they're doing something he'll go and support but that's what family do they go and they support and so he'll go up there and he'll, you know, go to the function and he'll come back or he'll go and visit his grandkids and uh, they all might go out to dinner and spend some time together because he misses them and he loved them. And ain't nothing wrong with that, honey. It isn't. He's really a good hearted person. And so he do his best. Well, that's a form of another healthy relationship. It's everybody working to make sure the relationships stay good because every relationship is work. Matter if it's with your family. Matter of is with your boo. Matter of is with your children. But thank God I ain't got that problem. <laughs> Ooh, Lord, let me put my hand together. Thank God for Jesus for the two he gave me. I ain't got no problems, none whatsoever. You know I'm going to keep speaking into existence. I ain't going to never have no problems. <laughs> that relationship going to maintain and be good. Mmm. Y'all yeah, pray for me too. Because right now my kids are young. You know, and they ain't got no wives. You know, that can change the dynamic of relationship, honey, y'all. You know, we all know. But I can honestly tell you, I do pray for my daughter-in-laws, even though I don't have them yet. Because I want them to know Christ for themselves. If they know Christ from this, for themselves, as well as my sons, it's going to be a good yoke that comes together. And, they gonna understand their mother-in-law. All she wanna do is love her kids. She gonna love you too. Especially your grandkids, you know? We all gonna be just one big happy family. I'm gonna take the good with the bad. And put a smile on my face. Mm-hmm. That's all they gonna see. And that's all that counts. Mm -hmm. Cause everything else, it would be up here. Just like Stan say. I would drive myself insane thinking some stuff that ain't true. And I'm not gonna do it. I'm going to portray on the outside exactly what is going to be on the inside. Listen, anything fester up in me? Suppress, suppress, suppress. <laughs> That's the truth. I'm telling you what the Lord love. That's the truth. I'm telling you. Well, y'all know time is winding up. 15 minutes go fast. I promise you. I love when I can just chit chat. It's like I'm in my element with you guys. And I really thank y'all for stopping by. I'm not going to tell no lie. Because it's something that you didn't have to do. But you did it. But now y'all know exactly what time it is. <laughs> this chick about to turn the lights out in here, honey. Deuces. Peace. Thanks for the visit. I'm out.